Hello, I'm Nereo Karabic. I'm a group leader in the Center for Neurogenomics and we study brain development. Hi, I am Isabella Zay and I am a master's student um, doing my thesis here in the Kalevich group. Hi, my name is Nikola Trokorac and I'm a PhD student in Kalevich group. Ciao everyone, I am Flaminia Calocantrighedonna and I'm a postdoc at the Neurogenomic Center here at Human Technopole in the lab of Nereo Kalevic. The focus of our group is to study the development of the human brain, which is the seat of our intelligence. We do that by studying neural stem cells and how they generate neurons that then contribute to the final size of the human brain. We also study molecular events that go wrong when this size of the brain is impaired which can result in intellectual disabilities and we are interested in addressing the mechanisms that can result in these disabilities. In this lab I can study how a specific population of progenitor cells called basal radial glia contributes to the overall expansion of the human brain. Now to address this question, I have established in the lab the brain organoid culture. Organoids are multicellular structures that exhibit the capacity to self-organize and form complex structures, which mimics the tissue of origin. So the beauty of using this organoid system is that you can study organogenesis in vitro in a simple environment. The focus of my research is centered around brain development in different neurodevelopmental disorders such as microcephaly in which the brain is smaller than usual or macrocephaly in which the opposite is the case and within my PhD research I try to better understand how brain develops, what can go wrong in the process of brain development and how to prevent it. I decided to do my master thesis here in HT in particular with the Kalabich group because uh, the type of research they do is what I'm currently interested in, which is neuroscience, and my thesis basically uh, regards um, doing some image analysis on uh, their data. I chose to come to Human Technopole because I was excited by the idea of contributing to set up a new research institute and to give my um, fingerprint to the future of, um, of the research here. I chose Human Technopole mostly because I believe in its huge potential and I believe that in years to come and in decades to come, Human Technopole really has a chance to become one of the best and scientifically most excellent institutions, not only in Europe, but also in the world. I think HD really offers the cutting edge technology that would really allow me to follow the science that I am most passionate about. And that's one of the main reasons why I decided to, do it, uh, to be here in HD. Um, also, I am surrounded by you know, like-minded scientists who are also very passionate about what they're doing. So you know, that gives me that extra motivation to, 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 to do my science. I think the biggest strength of Human Technopole is the breadth of scales it has in addressing biological questions, from single molecules all the way to large cohorts of patients. And for me, who is a molecular and cell biologist above all, so somewhere in the center along this scale, it is really fascinating how I can develop my research in both directions thanks to the interactions I have with my colleagues here at campus. Uh, one of the best opportunities that Human Technopole gave me is a chance to meet and work with uh, renowned experts in the field of neuroscience. HT here has taught me uh, most about uh, how even if two different groups and you're doing different research somehow at some point you can actually get to cooperate and help each other and do uh, your research in parallel so there's a sort of unification. If I had to describe Human Technopole in three words I would go with scientific excellence, professionalism and diversity. HT represents Synergy, energy, and um, scientific excellence. It's very international. It's yellow. <laughs> and it's uh, fun. Innovative and progressive science. And uh, yeah, it's uh, an amazing environment to do many projects and discover a lot of things about the world we live in and who we are.